Hello, this is Jess Shepard. Welcome to today's guided meditation. In this practice, we are going to focus on the Kundalini energy that runs through your body. I am very pleased to share this experience with you. If you are new to working with Kundalini, you may like to think of it as primal energy or life force. It is the energy that runs through your body that makes you feel alive and aware of the world around you. It is the same energy that runs through every living being. And in this way, it connects us to each other and life itself. You can imagine that Kundalini energy is like a serpent that sits at the base of your spine, laying dormant most of the time, until you choose to actively awaken the energy and use it for your highest potential. Let's begin by getting settled into a comfortable seated position either on the ground with legs crossed, or if you are on a chair, have your feet flat on the ground. Ensure that your hips are higher than your knees for comfort. You may also want to use a cushion or blanket beneath your hips to raise them. Allow your hands to rest in your lap or on your knees. And when you are ready, gently close down your eyes. Let yourself arrive in this moment, knowing that for the next half an hour, you have nowhere else to be. Just be here, present in this moment. Permit this thought to gently bring you into a place of peacefulness. With that in mind, this is where we are going to begin today. Notice your connection with the surface beneath you. Feel that your spine can grow tall and straight, extending the crown of your head toward the sky, and then soften your shoulders away from your ears. For the duration of this meditation, try to keep your spine tall without being stiff and rigid so that the kundalini energy can rise up through your spine with ease. Take a deep breath in through your nose and breathe out through your mouth. Deep breath in through your nose Gently breathe out through your mouth. Last round like this. Deep breath in through your nose. Breathing out through your mouth. Good. Now allow the breath to return to its normal rhythm and its natural flow. Now that you are settled, begin to draw your attention inwards.
as you do, you can leave the outside world for a little while and instead move deeper into the inner layers of your own body. What is happening inside your body? How do you feel here? How is your breath moving? How is your heart beating? As you become quiet, can you notice the soft and subtle energy that pulses through your body? Perhaps this feels like a tingling sensation in your fingertips or toes. Or maybe you feel it as a warm energy dancing in your hips or heart or another area in your body. Maybe you don't feel anything at all and that is also completely okay. Be kind to yourself. Let go of any expectations or anticipation that you may have and simply allow your body to guide you. One of the easiest ways to awaken Kundalini energy is through your breath. And this is what we're going to do today. Take a deep breath in now. And feel your body expand. As you breathe out, feel your body soften. As you draw your breath in through your nose, See if you can take it all the way down to the base of your spine, drawing the breath deep into the body. With the exhale, simply let the body relax even deeper as it softens. As you continue to breathe like this, Keep the focus on directing your inhale all the way down to your tailbone. Now as best as you can, see and feel the energy that is gathering at the base of your spine. You may imagine it as a golden light 
or you may simply like to focus on becoming aware of the energy as a sensation that you feel. Maybe you give it your own color or name, but from here, I will continue to refer to this image or sensation as energy. With each breath, see or feel this energy building as it gathers at the base of your spine. Inhaling deeply into the body, send the breath down to the tailbone. Exhaling, body softening. Become more and more aware of the energy building. This is the energy that will awaken the sleeping serpent that resides here. Breathing into the base of the spine can activate a number of emotions, both positive and negative. Notice what feelings of joy or of fear may be coming up for you and observe it without becoming attached to it. Each feeling is something that is happening inside you, but it doesn't have to define who you are. Just notice if any feelings arise with non-judgmental awareness. Every inhale invites energy into the body Every exhale releases any darkness, uncertainty or unnecessary feelings. This breath is cleansing and clearing the body as it moves through you. As the energy gathers more strongly at the base of your spine, 
gently, it awakens the sleeping serpent. Feel this awakening of energy. It begins. Allow this snake to curl around the base of your spine and very slowly slithers upwards. Keep breathing. It is smooth and gentle as it moves. Breathe deeply, inhaling and exhaling. The snake curls around your lower spine, reminding you of your primal energy. It activates the part of you that feels safe and at home within your body. It allows you to dissolve your fears and to connect with your truest self. Ground this energy into your body with another breath in and out. As the serpent continues to travel upwards around your lower spine, it also activates your pleasure center and allows you to feel more deeply the effect of this energy within you. It teaches you joy and pain, love and fear. But the snake knows that all emotions are welcome here. Feel what you need to feel. As the journey continues, snaking around your spine, it moves behind the diaphragm, activating your inner power center and the part of you that knows inner strength. Breathe into your full power. Allow yourself to feel confident in your body. With another breath, the serpent moves up and curls around the spine behind your heart. You also know that strength resides in your heart too, in the form of unconditional love and compassion. Feel the kindness that lives within you and the joy of sharing this compassion and love with others.
Continue traveling up. Feeling the serpent move around the spine, carving out its own pathway. As it moves through the throat, you are reminded of the power of your voice. If you need to, you can even let out a sigh or sound here. Truth and fearless expression are always welcome. The serpent continues to move upward, now reaching to the very top of the spine, where the spine meets the head. Here it continues its journey, energetically moving up through the base of your skull and behind your eyes. The serpent may bring you a vision, perhaps you can see his face or another image that is important to you. serpent activates the power of the mind and reminds you of your connection to all the energy around you. Breathe here and enjoy the energy that is clearing and opening your mind to new possibilities. Take another deep breath and see the serpent travel all the way up and out the crown of your head. The snake leaves your body and travels into the cosmos above. Floating and travelling higher and higher, up until you can no longer make out its form. Although the serpent leaves, you still feel the energetic path that is carved out as it travelled and moved through your body. Now the impression that it left within you is an energetic line 
that still holds a lot of power. The path that this serpent moved through is the same path that the kundalini energy can move through your body. With your breath, feel the energy as it continues to rise. Feel the imprint from the serpent and know that even without the snake, your energy is strong and powerful. As you rest here, you may choose to stay in stillness or you may also choose to allow this natural energy to move through you. You may want to sway or create circles with your spine. You may even notice that you are already doing this without knowing it. Let the energy in your body move however it wishes and enjoy a few moments here as you explore how the Kundalini energy feels within you. Take a deep breath in through your nose and exhale out 
through your mouth. Give yourself these next few moments to feel into the depths of your body. What is happening inside your body? How do you feel? Can you feel the subtle or perhaps not so subtle sensations of energy accumulating in certain parts of your body? Where is the energy gathering? Or where is the energy flowing? Observe your body for a few minutes as you enjoy the sensations of kundalini energy. Kundalini energy is a powerful energy of transformation. It can bring new insights, ideas and new sensations to your mind and body. You are always welcome to return to this Kundalini space and practice resting and observing yourself in this energetic state for as long as you need. Remembering that it is also important to ground yourself after being in this high vibrational state so that you can integrate back into the normal world. To ground yourself, place your hands on either the earth or the ground beneath you. If you are sitting on the floor or place your hands, palms face down on your thighs if you are sitting in a chair. Take a deep breath in and exhale with a loud sigh through an open mouth. Two more times like this. Deep inhale, strong open mouth exhale. One last breath and then let it all out. Begin to move your fingertips and toes and then shake your wrists to 
to embrace the full feeling of energy in your hands and arms. Continue shaking your hands as you bring your arms up over your head. Shake the shoulders too and maybe even gently roll your head and neck a few times. Allow yourself to come back into stillness for a moment. Notice the surface beneath you and the space around your body. Then when you are ready, gently open your eyes. Enjoy the activation of kundalini energy within you and tread lightly as you move throughout the rest of your day. Please feel free to share your experiences in the comments section below. This is Jess Shepard. Thank you for sharing these moments with me. My love and appreciation flows out to you.